So you're here because your anti-siphon valve either leaks, sprays water everywhere, or otherwise irritates you. I saw a number of videos on the internet about how to fix this, but I decided to do it a little bit differently using a uh, screw drill out uh, part. I'm going to show you how I did that here. Here's the part that I bought. Standard kit. I'll give a link in the description of the video. The faucet itself has a nut that has been broken off by the installer. Uh, per code, you can't get it out. Uh, I saw people using dremels and drilling holes in the brass itself, but using a drill with this bit, uh, center it carefully, slowly push in and turn in a counterclockwise direction, a reversing bit will drill into the screw itself. Then you remove the bit, flip it over, as I'll show you here. The other side is the actual extractor. The first side is a reverse drill, which uh, puts a counterclockwise drill in. This is the extractor. Turn it over. Uh, again, insert it and push firmly so that it doesn't spin and slowly uh, apply pressure and the screw should back out. Once it backs out, again, you'll see me turn it slowly and I'm putting a fair amount of pressure in there to make sure it doesn't spin. Once it backs out, there you have the uh, broken off pin that we couldn't get off. Once that's out, it should just back out with, uh, with hand pressure. So that's a simple, easy, quick way of getting rid of this. Uh, of course, you should replace it per code if you decide not to. That's your decision. In my case, I'm putting a quick connect on because we use this just for washing cars. Again, here's a close-up of the extractor with the set screw uh, left there. And then uh, we'll see the actual part that I purchased. And it's a great kit for removing any kind of broken off screws or any kind of problems that you might have with other... Uh, if you break off a bolt or a screw, you can use this to extract anything. I've used other models. This one actually has lasted and worked very well. If you like the content of this video, please use the link to buy the product. It'll help me out a little bit. I hope it helps somebody with their frustration. I'm glad I got mine fixed. Thanks.